Well, it's been an absolutely beautiful afternoon, mostly sunny skies at Lake Hartwell, Western Carolina Sailing Club. A little bit of a breeze to produce that chop on the lake, but the wind has really calmed down. It's going to pick back up, though, as we get into this weekend, and it's going to get a lot colder. Right now, we're under a freeze watch across much of Western North Carolina, and that's for Friday night. Also, snow expected Friday night in Western North Carolina, something we do not see very often this late in the season. Fox Radar 3D is clear right now. We're tracking that storm, the low pressure pushing down over Rapid City right now, some heavier downpours in Kansas. All of that's going to be transitioning our way and then could potentially bring a record breaking snowstorm to the northeast by late Friday into Saturday. So big, big weekend for weather across the East Coast, that's for sure. Tomorrow, the upstairs state just going to see some rain and that's going to start toward the late afternoon early evening and the rain will be fairly light as it looks now a lot of the uh, energy and moisture is going to be shifting north as this system swings through have a better chance for some heavier downpours in the mountains through the day and then we'll see that turn to snow later on in the evening so on the carolina sky meter i gave tomorrow a six since we've got a decent chance of rain and then some snow late in the mountains but the morning won't be too bad just cloudy not expecting a whole lot in the way of rain rain. Uh, take a look, 7 a.m. clouds roll in, a couple showers up in the mountains, but it's going to take a while for this rain to get here. There's 4 p.m. scattered light rain, so not a whole lot happening this time tomorrow. But then as we go toward 8 o'clock, We'll see a little more light rain push through some heavier downpours in the mountains and then it'll clear out late Friday night. But look what happens in the mountains. We see a transition from rain to snow, even a little sleet in the mix, and that will continue into Saturday morning. So we'll be watching for some light accumulations. Watch that snow up in the northeast too as the system gets cranking and intensifies as it moves northeast along the coast. Inland areas could see up to six inches of wet snow across portions of New England. Just crazy for this time of year. At least for us, conditions calm down this weekend for Mother's Day. Uh, it's going to be chilly, though, so be ready for a little bit of frost early on Mother's Day morning and a freeze possible in western North Carolina.